Hey guys, welcome back. Congratulations, you have now made it through section one of this SurfCam tutorial course. Uh, what I'm going to do now is just kind of do a brief uh, recap on what we've gone over this far. Uh, we've we've gone over all the buttons and and the interface. Uh, we covered how SurfCam uses views, and I explained the difference between world view and uh, coordinate view. I showed you how to rotate your part to get it in a machinable view, so that you can start programming it. Uh, I went over what a parent-child view is and how to use them. We covered uh, layers and how to manipulate geometry through different layers, how to uh, copy it and, and move it around to whichever layer you need it to be on. And last but certainly not least, uh, I explained masking. And we went over what it is and how to use it and why it is such a powerful tool in SurfCam. Now, uh, I, I hope that my approach to, to teaching this is, is working for you. Since you've made it this far, uh, I assume uh, that you like what you've been learning. And I try to make it everything as easy to understand as possible. And um, I believe that with what we've gone over so far, it'll give you a, a good solid foundation to build on with as we progress through this and as things get a little bit more uh, complex so just practice what you've learned um, practice your hotkeys and in the very next upcoming tutorial we're gonna jump right on into section 2 and start learning how to draw 2d geometry Okay, we're going to start off with um, how to draw lines, and I'm going to go through all the different uh, features and all the different options and, and ways to do that. Okay, so we've got the basics down so far. Um, now, now we're about to start, now we get to learn how to draw. All right, so we're we're not going to be doing anything with this part. I just had this on the screen because I thought it looked cool. Uh, you know, of course, eventually we will get to this eventually to something like this, but we've got a ways before we before we get that far. All right, so just hang in there, practice what you've learned, and tune in to the next tutorial, and we will start learning how to draw. Alright, thanks guys. I'll talk to you soon.